is that the Lama, uh, my Chinese uh, Buddhist name is Jin Kong Fa Shi. Welcome to the Tibetan Group of Brain Season. Hi, I'm Rama Lama, and today you will hear basic trivia about Tibet. Are you ready? Let's go. Why are we interested about Tibet? Because there's a growing population of Tibetan students in our school. Haven't you noticed? Almost each class has a Tenzin or a Tenzing. Is Nepal the same as Tibet? No, Tibet is an autonomous region of China, while Nepal is a separate country. Where is Tibet? Tibet is in a region on the Tibetan Plateau in Asia. Believe it or not, it's a part of China. What is the dominant religion in Tibet? Tibetan Buddhism. There is also a minority of Christians and Muslim. What is the capital of Tibet? Lhasa is the capital of Tibet. It is spelled L-H-A-S-A. -A, Lhasa. What is the population of Tibet? 3.18 million. How do you say hello? Tashi Dele. So next time you greet your Tibetan friend, Tashi Dele. Who is the Dalai Lama? He is the spiritual leader of Tibet. He is like the Pope of Catholic Christians. What is the real name of the 14 Dalai Lama? His complete name is Jetsun Jampel Nawang Yishi Tenzin Getso. Shortcut Tenzin Getso. Wow, that needs a nickname. What is Tibet fighting for? They are fighting for a political separation from China. They want to be an independent country. Free Tibet. What Tibetan museums can we visit in New York? We can visit the Tibet House in Manhattan or the Museum of Tibetan Art in Staten Island. Or we could just observe Tibetans in Jackson Heights. What is a mandala? It is a geometric figure that represents the universe in Hindu and Buddhist symbolism. And now you can see it in adult coloring books. What were the fa favorite movies shot in Tibet? Seven Years in Tibet. There are two versions of it. One in 1976 and one in 1977 with Brad Pitt as a leading actor. What about Angelina? What is the famous Tibetan food? Momo. This is the Tibetan dumplings, which is a steamed bun that has some sort of filling. Best ones are probably in Jackson Heights, Queens. What is the famous Tibetan saying? Tragedy, Tragedy should be should utilized as a source, source of strength. strength. No matter, no matter what, what sort of difficulties, difficulties how painful, painful experiences, experiences, if we lose hope, hope, that's our real disaster. disaster.